Uh, from traditional flavors to one of a kind brews, this local spot is sure to leave any beer lover satisfied. Rachel Wolf is live at Movement Brewing with a look around. Rachel, I was out there before they finished, so I'm excited to see what they've done. Good morning. Good morning, Lori. The bar is amazing. In fact, let's show the bar right now. They put the top on the bar because I heard when you were here last, they yes. didn't have this. So look at this cool herringbone pattern. See that down below? That's beautiful, the yeah, craftsmanship. Right. And then mm -hmm. this bar is very long. Look at how long it is. It's mm. probably about 100 feet long. You could roll a bowling ball on that bar. Not saying I might do that if I come here with friends. Don't do it. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, I won't do it. I won't do it. But no, this is a great little space. And it's, you know what's funny is like a lot of these brewing companies are like in a, maybe like a industrial type complex or, you know, like in an area that you wouldn't, just drive by so you have to look for it a little bit but once you come inside it's awesome join me right now Alana Cavanaugh and you are you are debuting a brand new area here in the brewing company show us what you guys have brought together yeah well we're so excited we've been open for about five months and we're finally uh, ready to kind of showcase the inside of this brewery construction and you know everything we've been going with COVID has kind of put us back so we're finally at the point where we can share our space with everyone let's walk um, shall we yeah so we have um this uh second room where now we have open for more space more people um we like to have we have not live bands in here on fridays uh, we also do some trivia and uh, it just allows us for more space in these times where we're supposed to be spread out more. Um, Let's talk about this mural because that is gorgeous. Right? That is actually was painted by my husband's brother, California Artworks. He is a muralist and he is so talented and he's actually going to do another one for us in the other room, but that'll come next summer probably. Awesome. Awesome. And then quickly show us these barn doors. Oh yeah. Uh, these were actually custom made for us by our contractor. They're beautiful. Um, we got some beer equipment in the back that we kind of uh, have hidden, um, and it just allows us some space. Yeah, because you know you have to have where you make the beer, right? <laughs> All right, so let's come back over here. I'm going to talk about in the next hit, thank you very much, Alana how they do it all, right? Like a little bit of a taste, a little teaser. You see this over here? See these beers? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Look how beautiful that is. I'm interested in this one right here. Mm, what do you think do. that is? That's I feel like it's maybe a... Seltzer. Tell me that one. What is that? Passion fruit guava seltzer. Pa Wait, so it's not, is it alcoholic? Yeah, yeah, 4.7% right, 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 alcohol. All right, all right. So that one is one you can drink just you know, yes, <laughs> I might be able to have that I on already, the air. But the rest of them, it. I think, uh, <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about that in the next 10 minutes, how they make all these beautiful brews here at Movement Brewing Company. That coming up in just a little bit. <laughs> Thanks, Rachel. Yeah, that's a great space. It is huge in there. And what I love about them, it's a family. They all work together and they've done a really nice job with that place. All right, Rachel, we'll see you up next hour.